whatever. She's checking what's in the background. <laughs> Many's the time we've done an intro and there's like a portaloo in the background or something. Anyway, morning. Hello. I Hello. Said I, oh, I said I wasn't going to say morning in case people watch it at night. Anyway. Hello. Hello. We're in Lincolnshire for the Easter weekend, which Can is. Can you that... call it Easter? You might offend people. Who gives a shit? <laughs> <laughs> it's Easter, it's always been Easter I'm 56 years old, nearly 57 Next month And it's Easter, so it's Easter weekend <laughs> Clearly <laughs> um, And it's the end of March Is it? Oh it is, yeah, because yep. it is Oh yeah And yesterday we got wet twice <laughs> Yeah, we did We had a, we had a, um, uh, a YouTube filming free day yesterday we did take a few photos yeah we did actually um, uh, um, but um, uh, might be able to stick one in of Poppy looking like a drown rat <laughs> she yeah. wasn't impressed <laughs> yeah, so walk into the pub I'll get in, in I'll get in, in a minute <laughs> go on carry on she's <laughs> on a roll I'm walk, a... walk into the pub and we got wet we sat in the pub and we decided to come back and we got wet coming back as well it was really April showers and it wasn't even April and it really came down heavy, didn't it? Is it my go now? <laughs> go on then. Are you sure? Hurry up <laughs> before I think of something else. Oh, God. Um, yes, as Heather said, we did have a day off YouTube yesterday. Um, we're on a rally with the Motor Caravanas Club. And uh, it, you could have come for four nights for 70 quid. So you could have come on the Thursday night. But I didn't really want to come straight after work. So we decided to come very early Friday morning. We left home mm-hmm. about half past seven in the morning. We were here for half nine, so we still got the full day, didn't we? Yeah. So we've, we've got three nights for 60 quid, but as we say, we didn't do any filming, just left the camera. I just, we didn't mm-hmm. feel like it for a change, did we? Yeah, no. Very, very rare, but we just thought, nah, we don't want to. We want to just be us with no camera, so we did. Um, anyway, it's basically a conference and events centre that this rally is at. Got full use of the toilets. There's a room at night where we went in for the entertainment last night. Showers. The showers. It's it's really it's like a Water, small campsite. Elton. Yeah. Yeah. It's like a and campsite. We're, we're almost on hard standing. I'm sure Rick will show I'll, you that. I'll show you. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna have this is gonna be over the next two or three days. Um, our usual ranting, farting, messing around. You know the score. And uh, we'll pick you up somewhere. Farting? Are you only you fart? Ladies, we'll pick, we'll, we'll, let, let off wind. Still, <laughs> still smells like crap. <laughs> Heather's mum says it's famous for daffodils in Spalding, and it probably is. There are loads. This is um, where we've just stood and done the intro. All m- myriad of different styles of daffodils, and there's loads of flowers on the the entrance in. This is where we are. Look. How many vans did they say they was here last night? 50, I think she said 54, didn't she? This Springfield Centre, I think it's quite famous in this area. It's got a shopping mall type place. It's we're not Americans, garden. we're not Americans, please. Uh, I don't know, they call them malls. I don't call I don't, them malls. Um, um, retail park. There we go. There you go, shopping retail park. Um, there's also a garden centre. And then there's supposedly lovely gardens. The problem is, is that... We can't take Pooch in any of those. No, dog can't go um, anywhere. I think she might be able to go around the garden centre, but certainly not around the... Uh, she had to stay in the van in the cage last night while we went in the yeah. entertainment. Use the new cage for the first time. There is the toilet block. These two white doors are showers. The Elson Point's just where that guy is there in the bins. And then around the other side is the toilets. And then this big white building's the conference centre where we were in last night for the entertainment. Here is an educational message from Heather. (laughs) Okay, I've just checked Google Maps and we are walking alongside Coronation Channel. And at the top end there's... A sluice gate really. Yeah, like a a dam type thing. Damn your eyes! (laughs) She's on one today, isn't she? (laughs) And um, then... and it, we, we suspect it stops water from going into the River Welland, which goes through the centre of Spalding. Because we're in the flatlands, you see, <laughs> I think. They do a lot of water diverting around here, to be honest, don't they, around this area? Because of it being so flat in Lincolnshire. Mm-hmm. Tell me if I'm wrong, but I believe that's the case. There you go. Um, anyway, 
we have no real plans today. We're going to walk into Spalding itself, and uh, we're undecided. We're going to go. Out, we're going to get a meal out. We always do that one of the days we're away. We're undecided if it's today or tomorrow. But it's it, as Heather's told you quite aggressively. It's Easter. It's it's Easter. I'm telling you. Even the dogs are excited, and um, it may be a bit busy tomorrow to go for a meal. Do you think? Easter Sunday. Easter mm. Sunday, possibly. We'll see what it's like today. See if yeah, we'll just we like we'll exactly. It is so fluid that we've got no plan. The only thing is, is that we have to eat out at least one of the days because I've only bought enough dinner for two days. Correct. But there's a Chinese just at the end of the road, and. Uh, and chippy and that sort of thing so we'll always find some at... did anybody order a Chinese <laughs> Gavin and Stacey joke there anyway I'm surprised you didn't do the what was, what was my damn your eyes yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we've that's, been, we've been re watching from, ghosts yeah she's mad on ghosts again now <laughs> so but yeah seems very hyperactive today maybe the ADHD pills haven't kicked in yet I don't know what's up with her <laughs> We made it to the end of the walk. This is where the Coronation Channel gets fed from the River Welland, did you say? Or the other way around. Or whatever, yeah, <laughs> one of the two. But yeah, it's horrible and dirty. Anyway, we're now going to walk along the river. All right, duck. Oh yeah, someone said that, didn't they? <laughs> Why don't you say, all right, me duck, when you see a duck? We don't. We're all about the swans. <laughs> yeah, we're going to walk along the river now hopefully back into Spalding if we can. If you watch the video that we did when we went to Woolerton Hall and then did that pub stop over and I fumbled around in the reeds going look a heron and you could just about see an out of focus heron. There's a proper one there look. There he is. <laughs> right we've made it into Spalding and uh, the boss has informed me She's been doing her research and has found a Always. micro pub, independent pub, yeah. whatever, you know. And it, it's very, very rare, as you know, we go to the pub. <laughs> so we're going to go and find that. It's called Prior, Prior's Oven. Prior's Oven. No. And then we'll go to a normal pub after that for some food. Apparently it's Easter. <laughs> it is Easter. <laughs> that told you. There's a Green King one. Ah. There's your pub. You said it was opposite the Green King. So there we go. The Prior's Oven. Let's go and have a look. <laughs> is she giving all the dogs your biscuits when we said yesterday we did no YouTube filming but we walked to the pub in the rain that was the pub we went to it was really nice I got confused because <laughs> I'm not very good with directions I said no it didn't look like that and Heather said we were on the other side of the road and we walked in from that way, of course, now I understand. Yes, we didn't swim from we this didn't, side. We didn't swim from this side across, did we? Um, Hello. I don't really know where we got to with filming. We were in that little micro pub, the Prior's Oven. It was great in there. So we ended up staying in there a bit. Then we went over the road to the Pied Calf, which was a... Green King. Green King pub. For dinner. For dinner. Only your normal pre-packed nonsense, but it was all right. Um, yeah, it was nice. No, it was nice. Watched a bit of the football. Not a fan of football. West Ham versus Newcastle. Newcastle. Now, apparently, I'm told that it's women's Six Nations and England are playing Wales on the women's rugby. Mm -hmm. So Heather's going to watch that this afternoon. Yeah, no, I won't go to sleep. A few pints. I don't know what I'll do. Anyway, we're thinking of being becoming a beer review channel. What do you think? <laughs> Tell us in the comments below. 
When was the last time you paid three pound fifty for a pint of beer? Answer: nineteen ninety-five. <laughs> anyway. Can you remember that far back? No idea if I'm going to film anything else until tomorrow. Guess you'll find out in a minute. Hello. Morning. <laughs> hello. You said hello. Oh yeah, hello. <laughs> Sorry. Been it's, told. It's I? the thirty-first of March. Easter Sunday. Yep. Easter. We haven't had a lie in because we've lost an hour. Yeah, we I don't well, know where yeah. it went, but yeah, clocks went forward. <laughs> in case you didn't know, obviously, um, you'll also notice we did no more filming yesterday when we got back from Spalding. We've come out pretty early this morning to have a look around the shopping outlet place. Yeah. Uh, we've left Poppy in the bank because no dogs are allowed, and uh, yeah, it's lovely. There's a lovely garden as well, so we'll show you around that. And then later on today, we are off back into Spalding, aren't we? Yeah, we're going to wander back in. You, yeah, you want to go back to, strangely, Heather wants to go back to that little micro pub. It was quite, it was really friendly, to be honest. They were really, yeah, they yeah. were really nice. And it was £3.50 a pint. It was. But, but it was Black Forest Gatto. Flavoured cider. Flavoured cider. Weird. I can't even say it. <laughs> anyway, so yeah. We'll, we'll show you round. In fact, what I'm going to do now while I'm talking, I'll, missing the ducks flying. I'll play in <laughs> some footage of a few of the shops and stuff like that because there's all music playing down there. So you'll see now pictures overlaid of that. And then we'll walk you around the garden and show you a bit of that before we go back and fetch the dog that's probably going mad in the van as we speak. <laughs> I thought we were getting rained on, but it's not. It's, some of the it's the blossom, isn't it, from the trees? Hello. It's not a cat. <laughs> Couple of guys with radio control boats there, look. R N L I one. Hello. You're very tame. Must be the place for herons, this. You see it straight in front of me. I feel we must apologise for the lack of swans in this episode. <laughs> it's been herons all day. Just the one heron, actually. Well, now we've seen at least two or three. Yeah, but it could be the same could heron. Could be the same heron. <laughs> Obviously, we'll never know. We've only ever seen one at a time. True, true. Anyway, it's uh, Sunday afternoon. Bit breezy, bit cold, isn't it? Really gone chilly. Yeah. After yesterday being lovely and warm. But we're gonna, we are walking back into Spalding as we said. Gonna pop back into the. Uh, Priory oven, I think you said it was called. Because Heather Prior. the Prior's oven. Prior. Heather really loved that black forest gatto cider, I don't know. And I'm I'm easily led as you know, so I'm quite happy to go and have another pint of whatever's on offer. Panic over. You know it would be a disappointing vlog without some on it. I know there's two unfortunately, but here we are stars of the channel and here we are back at the prior's oven why not rude not to and all that <laughs> nice to meet you oh that's a, a far superior mine's mine's great oh, yeah. oh nice to meet you yeah you've got off the belt he gets about this heron look that has got to be surely that's got to be the best shot i get bird spotting channel update I know it's always sad to see, but there you go. One on its own. All together now. We ought to rename this channel Beer and Birds. What do you think? Morning. Good morning. So, 
It's a sad day today. Is it? Yeah. We're selling Athena. Oh dear. it's the 1st of April. That was her pathetic idea of a joke, I think. <laughs> anyway, yeah, we're leaving now. Um, quickly to say, there'll be a bit of video playing um, over the top of my voice now. When we went into the pub, the, the Priors Oven yesterday, we had such a great time chatting to the locals and stuff like that. We do love them type of micro pubs. Um, and the guy was telling us the reason why the river was so dirty and brown is because the, the banks breached a while ago, so they actually dammed it and drained it, and that's just dirty rainwater effectively. But anyway, all through this video, you've seen me desperately trying to film a heron, and finally on the walk home, I got one close enough up that, um, yeah, it was quite a good shot really for me, considering. Um, but anyway, enough of that. Yeah, we didn't do a great deal more filming because as we were walking home, yet again it started raining on us. <laughs> uh, so we was just lit camera in the pocket and dive for home. Um, it's absolutely nailed it down all night, hasn't it? It has, yeah. Really, really wet. But anywho, we've had a great time. The Saturday was the best day. It was really sunny and no wind. But we've enjoyed ourselves and that's the main thing. So anything to add before we, we're going to go and find some gas now? Apparently there's a gas place right local. Yeah, we've um, used a fair bit of gas this weekend because yeah, if you if you're ever near Spalding, there's a Morrison's that hopefully hopefully has got gas. <laughs> has got gas. Uh, yeah, where... but batteries have we've done three nights, three days and three nights off grid. Batteries have done well. Um, yeah, we've used about half a tank of gas though. But hey ho. Well, you don't know that you've used half a tank. Well, the display says so, the, but the that's about as accurate as me. <laughs> anyway, no. well, well. Go and get the gas and then we'll let you know how much we actually ended up putting in. Oh, will we? Okay, we'll do that. <laughs> so, Morrison's at Spalding, or Pinchbeck, whatever you want to call it, doesn't have LPG. <laughs> so uh, we haven't filled up, so we can't... Got, it's so, got the pumps. So, 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 yeah, uh, so we can't tell you how much we used <laughs> or anything. So, there we it's, go. It's <laughs> getting harder to find. 100%. Maybe all the scare stories were true. Um, anyway, we've got enough to find some next weekend or the weekend after, haven't we? You know, plan the route on actually finding some. Yeah. But anyway, pretty much I'm done if you're done. Don't forget to do what the screen's telling you to now. With these fancy graphics, making um, silly noises. I, I sometimes turn the noises off. I didn't know how to do that first, admittedly. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching as always, and we'll catch you on another one. Yes, thank you everybody. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.